So for you, what has it meant to be a part of this franchise? I know you do a lot of horror cons and you talk to a lot of fans, but for you, what has this meant to you all these years later to be a part of this iconic series? You know, it took years to realize how important or great or what an honor it was. Because when I was doing it, I hadn't seen any Friday the 13th movies. I didn't know anything about them. Uh, actually, when I got cast, I asked to see part four. So I would know some of the history at least, you know? So it took all these years to find out through the fans that it was, first of all, an honor to be a final girl. Um, I learned the importance of the franchise and, and the love for it and, and just the loyalty to the whole franchise. Have you enjoyed just the messages that you get from the fans now through social media? And, um, you know, what's what kind of stories do they tell you just about you being in that well, home? I hear stories from people about how it touched their lives. It gave them, when they were a teenager, it gave them uh, um, strength. They somehow related to me, the character. They found me to be uh, very strong and um, uh, inventive in how to save myself. So the stories are that they were going through a tough time in junior high and high school. Uh, some of them were gay coming out and bullied. So I do get so many messages from guys and girls who were bullied or who don't have self-esteem and I talked to them about that. I, I've talked to a lot of people about that because that's very important. One thing I never lost was my self-esteem. I had a lot of stuff happen to me in life and in business, especially Hollywood. But you can't ever lose your self-esteem. You have to believe in yourself because you're going to meet people all the time to tell you you can't do it. You can't do it. No, we won't let you do that. And you just have to pick up and, and keep trying.